Sister Desiree of Jesus. Lord, you have called me. Here I am. Sister, what do you ask of God and his holy church? I ask for God's merciful love, the property of the order, and the companionship of the sisters in this monastery of the most holy trinity, Nothing Hill, of the discounts lands, of the order of the Blessed Virgin Mary of Mount Carmel. Thanks be to God. Dear sister, in baptism you have already died to sin and have been set aside for God's service. Are you now resolved to unite yourself more closely to God by the bond of perpetual profession? I am. Are you resolved, with the help of God, to undertake that life of perfect chastity, obedience and poverty, chosen for themselves by Christ our Lord, and his virgin mother, and to persevere in it forever. I am. Are you resolved to strive steadfastly for perfection in the love of God and of your neighbour by living the gospel with all your heart and keeping the rule and constitutions of your order? I am. Are you resolved, with the help of the Holy Spirit, to spend your whole life in the generous service of God's people? I am. Are you resolved to live for God alone, with Mary, in solitude and silence, in persevering prayer and willing penance, in humble work and holiness of life? I am. May God, who has begun this, the good work in you, bring it to fulfilment before the day of Christ Jesus. Amen. Amen. Dear friends in Christ, let us pray to God the Father, who gives us everything that is good. In his mercy may he strengthen his servant in the purpose he has inspired in her. Jesus, desiring to live faithfully with the Blessed Virgin Mary, a life of allegiance 
to Jesus Christ with my sisters as witnesses. Into your hands, Sister Mary of St. Joseph, bow to Almighty God forever. Chastity, poverty, and obedience according to the rule and constitution of the discussed nuns of the order of the Blessed Virgin Mary of Mount Carmel. With my whole heart, I give myself to this religious institute, restored by St. Teresa, to seek perfect charity in the service of our mother, the church, by the grace of the Holy Spirit and the help of the mother of God. Through constant prayer and evangelical self-denial and to give eternal glory to the most holy trinity. Son with our mortal flesh, in the chaste womb of the Virgin Mary, patroness of the Carmelite Order, pour out your abundant blessings on this day, and grant that your servant who wears it on earth may be a sign of the resurrection to come and be clothed in the glory of eternal life. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Receive this veil as a sign of your consecration, and keep unbroken faith with your heavenly bridegroom, who proclaims that you belong entirely to Christ and to his mystical body, the Church. Amen. Amen.
mercy, broke the bread, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up. God inspires all holy desires and brings them to fulfillment. May he protect you always by his grace, so that you may fulfill the duties of your vocation with a faithful heart. Amen. May he make each of you a witness and sign of his love for all people. Amen. Amen. May he make those bonds with which he has bound you to Christ on earth endure forever in heavenly love. Amen. Amen. May Almighty God, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, bless all of you who have taken part in this celebration. Amen. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying the Lord by your life. Amen. 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 Amen.